Hey guys, welcome into WP Cliff Notes. In this second video of a two-part mini-series on Local by Flywheel, we're going to discuss how to migrate a website from MAMP into Local by Flywheel. Guys, my name's Cliff Kennedy, and let's get started with this tutorial. Let's jump to the computer. Hey guys, welcome to the computer. Now we are going to migrate a site from MAMP into Local by Flywheel. I've actually already logged into the site. This is what it looks like. Next we'll go to the dashboard and we're going to use a plugin called Duplicator. So we'll go to plugins, then we will go to add new and type duplicator. Then next we will install and then activate the plugin. And now that we see that the plugin is activated, you will see this little tab right here called duplicator. And then we will go to packages or create new and then hit next and then it'll scan your site it'll give you these little notices some of these you don't have to worry about so then you click yes and then hit build now this process right here might take a little while so I am going to pause the video until this finishes alright guys now that the um, backup has finished we are gonna click the archive we do not need the installer so we are gonna click the archive and download it I'm gonna download it to the desktop depending on how big your website is the a building package process and the download process might take a few minutes depending on how big your website is all right now that the downloads done I'm going to start local by flywheel and I'm going to turn MAMP off. Alright, now that Local by Flywheel is ready to go, um, your next step will be find the archive of your website and mine is on the desktop. And so you'll just drag it on here. You'll name your website. Then next you will click what preferred or custom. I'm going to go with preferred. And then I'm going to hit import site. And then again, depending on what size your website is, is depending on how long this will take. So again, I'm going to pause the video and let this work alright guys so you need to put in your computer password to give your computer permission to create the folder for your sites and after you do that it's gonna start configuring WordPress and setting up your site alright guys so there you go your sites created and we will go to view site to show you that's all I have for this tutorial, guys. Thanks for watching. That's how easy it is to migrate your website locally from MAMP into Local by Flywheel. I hope today's tutorial has made WordPress simple, fun, and easy for you. Until next episode, my name is Clifton Kennedy, and I am signing off. Later.